Hello everybody. So through this session, we'll uh, continue with the next chapter of first flight that is Miss Bill the Otter by Gavin Maxwell. However, uh, Gavin Maxwell lived in uh, Camisferena in the West Highland of uh, Scotland and uh, his dog died actually, Jenny died and after that uh, uh, it was uh, too difficult for him to think again to keep dogs as a pet because he was so much attached with his uh, uh, dog so uh, he was so sad but then life without a pet or was also so lonely so he decided to keep uh, some other creature some other animal as a pet only uh, and uh, he decided to keep otters as uh, as a pet only however in uh, early in 1956 uh, he traveled to southern iraq only and uh, then it the idea came to his mind only that he should keep uh, otters as a pet uh, instead of a dog only uh, because uh, in iraq otters used to be there and arab people also used to keep these otters as a pet so he thought the idea came in his mind that he should keep otter as an as a pet only and as these um, otters they used to live in marshy areas uh, watery areas and his place also camasferena is also uh, means uh, water was not far from his place uh, there is a word used uh, phrase used at a stone's throw from his uh, door means at a very uh, near uh, from his uh, native place uh, there was a water sources also so he thought that as an experiment he should have otters as pet and what was the experiment experiment of keeping otter as an as a pet only instead of a dog so as he was in uh, uh, Iraq only he just shared this idea with his friend and his friend also uh, told casually that he if he wanted to have uh, otter as a pet he might he should get it from tigris marshes only uh, casually he said so and, uh, and then things uh, went on after that he di did not discuss anything about that however his friend told that uh, these otters are as uh, large number there as mosquitoes and these other people also used to keep them and then they were going to their consulate journal office only for collecting some mails which they were expecting from England only and uh, so when they reached there uh, they found that uh, his friend's mail has reached but his own mail was not reached there so he had to wait for four five days because uh, uh, for first day uh, there was some problem as the line was out of order a uh, second day it was uh, uh, office was uh, closed because of a religious holiday on third day also there was another breakdown so his friend left from there and uh, on the fifth day only uh, Maxwell Gavin Maxwell uh, received his mail from uh, England so he collected his mails he collected his letters and then he directly went to his bedroom for reading the letter only but when he reached there he found that uh, in his room only two other people they are sitting on the floor and uh, beside them only there was a large sack uh, in which there was something and the sack was uh, just twisting uh, moving also so uh, they handed him a note from his friend and on the note it was written that uh, here is your otter so um, in that way Maxwell Gavin Maxwell got uh, uh, his new pet as uh, as an otter only so gavin maxwell uh, told us that uh, with the opening of the sack that large bag in which uh, in which uh, the auto was kept with the opening of that uh, new phase of his life also began and uh, which would end with his own life only that was a kind of such an exciting experience for him long and exciting experience for him and he told that he loved his uh, uh, new pet so very much and that it was kind of auto fixation only that whoever he meets after that he used to talk to them about his daughter he loved his new pet so very much uh, first of all he told us about its uh, 
uh, features only when he took out otter from the sack from the large bag only on the tiled floor uh, it appeared like to him like a middle ages uh, dragon those imaginative creatures and uh, from head to uh, tail it was totally covered with mud only and uh, at, at some places where the mud was not there he could see uh, some a uh, velvety skin uh, some velvety uh, hair a uh, chocolate uh, brown colored and uh, he was so much excited about his new pet so as and whenever it used to shook itself uh, um, uh, gavin used to expect that a, a large dust of smoke will uh, uh, get in the air but um, uh, he told that it will it took him only a full month only in the second month only he was able to see the real um, otter behind those mud coverings only so further he told us that for first 24 hours uh, otter was neither hostile uh, and nor it was friendly it was uh, just uh, kept lying in a corner of the room only uh, sleeping only and not showing any interest in the surroundings that day uh, but on the second night it came on the bed of uh, author and it slept uh, near the knees in the crook shape only and uh, near the knees of uh, uh, the author and during the day it started showing uh, interest in the surroundings there uh, maxwell told that uh, he named uh, the author as uh, miss will however it was uh, uh, named by geologist as uh, maxwell's author because uh, it was uh, or it belonged to a rare species which was unknown to the scientist which was unknown to the science before that so they came to know through a uh, maxwell's author only th about this new species of otters that's why they named it as uh, maxwell's otter a uh, maxwell uh, made him uh, made a body belt for otter and he took him to a uh, bathroom also for washing it now there only the author came to know about otter that they love to play in water for half an hour the otter was just it went wild with joy in water plunging and jumping and going down in the bathtub and just uh, just using utilizing every drop of water it just was uh, just playing enjoying itself fully and a characteristic of uh, otters also came to be known that uh, they wanted water to be on the move they don't want water to water in a still position if it is in a still position it means that it is wasted so every water every single drop of water should be spreaded over the area it should be on the move if it is in a bowl only bowl should be overturned and if it is a larger bowl which cannot be overturned then it should be splashed every drop of water should be splashed should be utilized so that was the, the, the nature of uh, otters they they loved to play with water and uh, if they found water in a static position still position it was kind of a provoking to them it was kind of as if it was irritating them and then that's why they used to uh, just to splash that water two days later also uh, however he came to know maxwell came to know about something more about otters that as he opened the door a uh, miss a uh, quickly ran from the room he escaped from the room and he he, he came to know that the, the otters used to be so fast also they used to run so fast as he saw uh, just try to see it only he could only see its tail moving uh, turning towards the corridor only and then he uh, went after it and found that otter has entered into the bathroom and it has just uh, climbed up to the tap only trying to open the tap and luckily enough it was uh, able to turn it and full uh, splash of water was there and then it started enjoying in the water so uh, author uh, sorry maxwell came to know that they used to be so sharp also intelligent also so a uh, good observer also only once only he saw uh, the author how to uh, turn the tap only and that only he learned that just by turning that something and the water used to come out however author maxwell uh, tells us that uh, uh, that that day he was uh, lucky enough fortunate enough that he was able to turn the tap in a right position in later days only later occasions only 
instead of opening that he uh, just uh, turned it tighter and that it got he got irritated also by that so that day he was lucky but that uh, it had such a great uh, presence of mind and such great uh, intelligence also that it was it knew that by just uh, uh, turning something only water was uh, on the flow further maxwell told that um, about otters that how intelligent these creatures used to be otters that uh, soon he was as he used to call his name so wherever it used to it used to come back to uh, maxwell uh, just realizing that it was co called and then uh, most of the time it used to uh, spend in playing only and it has its own games also it used to love to play with the ball and uh, like a four feet uh, soccer player it used to play with the ball whole day and it used to juggle with the uh, things also and uh, the things uh, uh, it could throw the ball into the air also with the flick of its neck uh, it it has a great throw of, uh, and a powerful neck also uh, but the real play uh, for an auto uh, for this auto was uh, uh, lying on his back and juggling with the things juggling with small balls or uh, with his paws and uh, without uh, dropping them down apart from this uh, marbles were also very favorite of uh, otter and uh, it used to lie on his back and uh, roll those uh, marbles on his flat belly without dropping them so it used to enjoy itself so very much uh, however this is the first part of your chapter only and we will continue with the uh, chapter in our second part